Next question. Uh, in a 2D tug of war, Alex, Betty and Charles pull the rope uh, that are tied on an uh, automobile tire and uh, they are as shown. The angle between the Alex and the Betty's force is 137 and the Alex's uh, force value is 220 Newton. Let's omit the unit for now. Charles is 170 and this is unknown and uh, this is also unknown. Okay, and this is stationary. So definitely the net force will be zero. So let's try to make an FBD over here. Uh, and we have to uh, do that. The net force should be zero. So we have to make the components as well. So let's say this is the uh, horizontal and the vertical line. So definitely this is 90. And since this complete angle was 137, so uh, what will be this angle? This will be 137 minus 90, right? Uh, alpha. So alpha is going to be 137 minus 90 which is going to be 47 degrees. Uh, let this angle be theta, which is unknown. And uh, this force is 220. This force is 170. Mm -hmm. So we are going to make the components, of course. So this will become 170 cosine of theta. And this will become 170 sine of theta. And this will become 220 sine of alpha. And this will become sorry 220 cos of alpha and this will become 220 sine of alpha and this is the unknown force f which we have to find so since this is an equilibrium everything uh, or the horizontal and vertical total forces should be zero right so summation of fx should be zero net force towards the x direction is zero which means that 170 uh, cosine of theta should be equal to 220 cosine of alpha. So if we divide both sides by 170, cosine of theta will be 220 over 179 times cos of alpha, where alpha is 47 degrees. Uh, so let me just grab my calculator and get the value of theta from here. Cos of 47 and the cos inverse of this value comes out as 28.04. 28.04 degrees is the value of theta. Okay, and let's do the same thing with the vertical force this time. So let me just try to make some space over here. Uh, if we do the same with the vertical forces, then Fy should be zero, which means that 170 sine theta plus 220 sine of alpha should be F. So if you flip the equation, then F will be equal to 170 sine of theta, where theta is 28.04 plus 220 sine of alpha, where alpha is I think 37, right? 30, uh, not 37, 47, 47 degrees. So all we have to do is, is uh, find this up using the calculator, of course. So sine of this times 170 plus 220 times sine of 47. So this is eventually, make sure your calculator is actually in degree mode because every angle is in degrees. So this is coming as 240.82 Newton. That is the force of Betty. Thank you.